going on, y'all? Can we full screen that hoe? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, went out. The whip. Did it's we so whip it out? Black. Yeah. Yeah. Probably the back cave. Still black, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. Still black. Yeah. Still black. Cars and I start. Yeah. Yeah. Are we live? Yeah. So people are oh. hearing us. Okay. Oh. You are hearing our voice, but we are still amongst technical difficulties. We in the black. We in the black. And we back. This is now loading. I can see me. I can see Pat. I can see a chick in her underwear. There now I just see underwear. us. What's happening? What's going on? Cleo is a ghost. Because it's his birthday. It's his birthday. He's celebrating day. with his it's familia. His yes, he is. Uh, but today we're playing Grand Theft Auto Five. This game has been out since 1998. Yes. And they have been... Putting so much down, it's like it, it's been alive forever. Like yes. I don't really know when it came out, but it seems like they've been. Uh, they downloaded like, how much DLC is there at this? I had so many. There is so many it's now. It's still alive. Uh, it is and ridiculous. Kicking. Yeah. Uh. So yeah, I think it's been around like seven years now, and we are still live and direct. So we're gonna jump in it since this is kind of an easy going. You know, you know how downloading is. We just kind of play back. That didn't, that we laid back. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to go well either, but uh, <laughs> we laid back. But uh, we have a feeling for Cleo. Yes, we do. Jump in? We're going to switch play we and jump, jump in. in. Remember our producer, Micah. Micah the producer. R.A. Racially ambiguous. Racially ambiguous. Racially ambig. What you call it? Fleek living? <laughs> Fleek living. Fleek living. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Gerard yeah. Temple. So uh, we're gonna be checking y'all comments uh, for our tokeners. I got them pulled up right here. But we're gonna start off. Welcome to my world in G. Welcome to my life. Hey, this is my life. So first off, we're gonna start off with what I look like. I didn't like what I look like, so I turned myself into a fucking villain. Okay. You see the you see the fit. Let's it's you, you look like a, a villain on laundry day though. Like where's your suit? This you is my sweat? suit. This is my he suit. A, he got a hoodie? Right around comfortable. These right. are these are carbon fibered suits used in a heist. Check the swag out, man. But <laughs> this is how I do it. Comfortable, okay. But you know what though? I'm 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 today for y'all, I'm switching my game up. Okay. Now this looks like Spider Man's first outfit. Right? I'm not mad. Oh, I'm, what? That's what you look like underneath? That's what I look like underneath. What the Apparently hell? Apparently, they... they I they, not guess that. Yeah, yeah but keep the, vet, keep the mask. You should keep that mask on. You look yeah. like... Uh, who's that rapper? You look like Riff Raff. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yo, Riff Raff. So, I'm going to go... Walking I'm, around the city, though. I'm, I'm going to go... So, so I'm going to go in this today. Riff Raff But I'm going to put the villain. mask on. I got different masks. Ain't that a bitch? Got different masks. Please put the mask on. Yes, I don't I don't walk around without it. It's, it's not a good look. It's just so shiny. Yeah, oh that God, yeah. it's horrifying. Yeah, Are you black? Yes. Yeah, apparently so. Why'd you give yourself yeah, vampire? Racially ambiguous, right? Yeah, what vampire like, eyes. That's racially ambiguous. Yeah. Why would you give him those eyes? Yeah, go with the go with the spec ops. So we got we got we got we got options. We got options. I I am a fan of the tactical. We got we got this one right here. That's weird. That is very yes. weird, but I got it. We got the gas okay. vest. My favorite so far. You know what I'm saying? I'm going with the yellow or white. Probably the white one. Let's go with the white one. This is what we oh. rocking today. So this is how we're gonna get the day started. This is what one kind of I'm, mischief we doing. I'm gonna I'm, I'm I'm take y'all through my life. Like I've done a lot of crime, a whole yeah. bunch of shit. There's a whole lot of gang shit been going on. Got it. You have a very small <laughs> kitchen for a drug yeah. lord. Oh no 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 no! See, ass. no no! You see now? See, I, this is safe house. This is just a safe house right here. Cause see, I'm Got doing it. something. Real fancy, real big. It's like a sitcom is shot here. Like the it is, Max but this show. where I'm at right now, y'all finna see. We're gonna go to the garage real quick. Now I want to show y'all what I got Slight in the garage. Flex. Got it. You know, for just for, as, how, for how cheap the kitchen looks, definitely is a safe house. Right. Yeah, you know. Yeah. I just like to keep a few Ooh. old school whips, you know. I like that. You better you not have no low driveway. Nah, no <laughs> low driveway. I call that the uh the ghost rider right there. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That one is dope. This is the Get Smart. If you remember that Steve Carell movie, I did. That's why I got this. Get the get, get take the Get Smart out. Classics, 
right, we're gonna Let's take go this out. smart out. All right, we're gonna back this out now. See, I'm actually doing some things right now. We're about to be in the city of Polito Bay. So Polito Bay is kind of like the dock marina area and stuff like that. Real small, real small area as you can see. Okay. Polito. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Polito Bay. We out here in the bay all day. Right so what here. part of fake Los Angeles is this? Supposedly. Um, in fake Los Angeles, this is probably like yeah, Bakersville, maybe. You Willie know, almost hit you, cuz. I know he almost hit me. Then we got Willie's back there. Okay. That's where I live, right behind. So I'm gonna first take y'all to, uh, like I said, Willie. spend a whole lot of gang shit going on. All right. I'm gonna take the back entrance. Oh, oh okay. I, I, Fuck yeah. the front. At some point, you just stop caring. Yeah. You try to be as careful as long as you can, and, and then, then it's just yeah, like you make this one mistake. You break the oh, seal. Uh, windshield is shattered. You break the seal. Oh yeah. What, once the bumper goes, you just be like, "Fuck it." And it's just like, all right. Well, what, once do the, I even need this car? You yeah. about to drive it off a cliff? Nah. <laughs> I'm taking y'all to my facility. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah. You know, I got a whole facility, man. I told you, man. This ain't just your. Re- I'm not your average no. drug dealer. What the hell is this? Like an airplane elevator? I mean, it's a hangar. Doomsday facility, man. I yeah. saved the world once. And you're supplying it drugs. Yes. Nice. What a great day. Good I balance. sell drugs to the community yeah. and I save the world. In this world's free, man. Exactly. But welcome to my facility. This is what it is. These just random cars for, you know, co- what? workers. You got a Nissan? I mean, it's workers. These are the, the workers right. park here. Right. You know what I'm saying? The workers park here. Like, they got a park. Keeps you modest. Yeah, yeah they got a park. This is really a facility. Home. Yeah, this is my facility this right here, like man. looks like Get Smart, for sure, but like yeah. the villain version. What's yeah. that little glowing marker? That's a go back up, but we're not going back up just yet. You know, take y'all inside. You know, we, we still renovating in here. That's where all of the... Uh, Costumes and stuff supposed to go, outfits and stuff. But this is, this is a little pad right here, man. I don't man. think I would want to be a drug lord. Well, I'm at, at this. I'm always stress, stressed out. At this time, I'm, I'm probably yeah, bigger I, than that. I feel like every drug lord's always Look like, at I got awards. Pool with tons of girls and, and drugs around. That's like the one day off they have. Right. Everything else is like. I mean, it's yeah. usually them at a giant desk sitting like this, stressed the fuck out, all <laughs> drinking at 1 p.m., the most hardest. Harshest you know, bourbon. By bodyguards. Yeah. Yeah. People and shit. Wife hit like hidden at some safe house. All the phones bugged and shit. All right. This sounds down, terrible. It's a downstairs location. This is where they fight and counter terrorism. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, make sure. So, okay, you literally are happy. You're the cops. I mean, you know, I, I'm. You're the cops on one floor and Pablo Escobar on another. How does I that mean, work? I, I am Why don't very. Any of these niggas call the police on you. Why would they when I sign their checks? You going to sign on the person that feeds you and well, your of family? Course. I'm just saying. It seems like they're looking for you. <laughs> I mean, but maybe they're not. I'm saving the world. Obviously, I'm working with somebody that ain't worried about drugs no more. Just a little, you know, waiting area for y'all to sit in and stuff. Why I be diabolical and shit. Let me take you to the headquarters real quick. Headquarters. Man, shoot somebody. I'm going to shoot somebody real soon. Just boom. Look at this. That's what happens when I save the world. I'm going to kill this damn fly on air. On air, you going to get it? All fly right. going to die. Now, let's go find... Man, I'd have to give me, like, a fucking scooter or something. Right. I'd be skateboarding through my doomsday facility for sure. It's the only Way crappy the thing about this. Torito... Uh, ter- uh, ter- what? Terry Topsis, were you guys aware that water buffaloes are allergic to cinnamon? Oh, Anybody shit. know that? Water buffaloes are actually mm-hmm. super dangerous. Like, Didn't even where know. Where the hell are water buffaloes? Right. Didn't know people were in the buffalo water buffalo game like that. Right. Executive search. Are you on a mission? No, it's just like, so when you're online, they'll give like random searches, random missions that you can do and stuff. Um, and then you have the event time person that has the most wins. But right now, it's time to get some killing in. I feel like getting in some killing. Yeah. As soon as I get over these rocks. Murder. It's been a murder. All right, so I'm going to let you select the guns. Where are we going, Pat? I got a got gang of guns. guns. Left. No, uh, uh, that and the shotgun. Shotgun? Yeah. All right, what kind of shotgun you want? 
Oh, snap. We got, shotguns. We got shotties. Shotties. That one. that one. You want this one? The big thumper? Is that what it's called? Nah, that's what I call it. Okay. Let's go find us some people and get messy. See, and on PC, you can just hold the sprint button. You don't have to tap it. Yeah, see, it does this then. You know what? Give me this truck. I don't want you to have this truck. Let's call my Come truck. truck is. That's a big clutch Chill truck. Chill ass out. That's a big clutch truck. Boom. That is the you running? Truck. You running, bro? You running? Yeah. Oh, so you just been chasing him, huh? You running, man? You dying for Seems being personal. a punk. I mean, you know, it's all oh, oh, snap. Oh, karma. I, it's right? Oh, and then and you didn't die? Same, it was the same truck. Yeah, that nigga got up and started running. The guy who tried to steal your car? Oof. Oh, damn. Would you run over him? It was life or death. Probably. Man, that's it for him, man. That's it for that guy. Yeah, that was such a specific attack. What'd he do? He didn't throw nobody else. I mean, sometimes you There's just... Another truck. Everyone's just rolling deep, bro. Everybody's just rolling deep, man. But Everyone you know got what? this truck. This truck is high selling. Man, oh, this truck. Oh, damn. Nigga, just, that guy. You know those tires are like $1,000 deep. Right? Or I'm a menace, man. This Nigga, is what in, I do. Inconvenience them at the least. I did. That was a, that's going to be a major inconvenience for them. He just has a big interview. Let's go fuck someone's day up for sure. Man, everybody at work. I was about to say, this is not very populated. But nah, then again, this... neither is Los Angeles but... sidewalks. Like say, man, hey, 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 you know where the corner store at, Cubs? Hey, hey, man, oh. I'm just trying to, hey, man, I'm oh, just trying to nice, just man. ask you a question, man. Uh, hey, man, why sorry, you walking on? change. <laughs> you ain't got no change. You ain't got no change, man. Oh, my God. He's black. <laughs> oh my God, he's black under the mask. Get out of there. Oh my God, so motherfucker. Ooh, you stuck the nail launcher on the gas. On the gas? That's really close. Oh. Yikes. Uh oh. Looks like we got a party Ooh, started. Oh, I'm dead, dead. Wow, and there you go. And that's what happens when you play with the fire. Jeez. I need to get to a helicopter now. Need to find me a helicopter. So you know what we're gonna do instead? I ain't gonna get a helicopter. You calling somebody? I'm not calling nobody. I'm calling my car. Calling your car. I'm calling my car. There we go. Yeah, man. But I'm out here in Polito Bay for a reason. I got a lot of drug things set up here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I got a, I got a whole lot of gang shit going on. I got a coke lab. I got a meth lab. I got a oh, counterfeit man. What? I mean, hey man, man, do you want to see it? It's real Breaking Badish. Uh, yeah. It's real, Show us the meth lab. It's real Breaking Badish. Like, oh, here go one of my cars. Car. Huh. Now I got the whole Avengers set in my garage. I'm gonna show y'all that in a little bit. This is the Iron Man Mach One right here, the armored Karuma. Yeah, that's good stuff. You doing that? Yeah, oh, man. I've been. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's well, fine. it can roll it down. Yeah, this is literally like a, this is an armored car, so you can literally run up to people and be shooting out your shit and can't nobody do nothing. Yeah, take you to go, take you to go see the meth. Yep, kill him, murder him, murder him dead. Uh, here we are. My coke lab is right there across the street. <laughs> so then, casual. Yeah, you know, and then my, my meth lab is over here. Oh, that does look like a meth lab. Definitely a meth lab area. All right. Show y'all how my meth the, lab It looks rolls. like a, it could be only a meth lab or a prison. Hey, man. <laughs> Some say it's kind of in the middle of both. Why? You know, how you looking at it? Meth lab prison. No so this lab. is the meth lab right here. Like I said, I watched Breaking Bad and I was like, you know what? Yeah. Why not? I mean, you know, sometimes I get bored and want to have a great time in video games. So bow, everybody. Let you work choose here. like colors and stuff. Yep. No, and you can upgrade stuff. So like security, this. Look at that. That's the blue magic right there, man. Yeah. Look at that. Heisenberg shit. That's really fucking meth. Wow, they're really bagging up meth. My bitch throwing meth in a container. That's crazy. Get it. Let me get my ass up out of here. Man, it can rack in about maybe 200,000, and then I go drop it off for a little bit more depending on that where I want to go. 
That was only 200K? No, 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 no. It fills up. So, like, supplies, when I buy supplies and then the product fills up, you could probably get probably like $250,000, depending on where you're delivering it. So, I got my Coke over there. They got naked bitches over there with the Coke. But, you know, y'all haven't seen enough drugs. Um, let me show you what else I done got into. This Are there any missions? There's missions. We're going, and we we getting there when we get to the garage. And then that's when we're going to interact with some of y'all that's on here. So I hope some of y'all are online on Xbox right now. Because um, I'm going to be requesting y'all to come get into my world. Just come join the game. And we're going to get it in. But I'm going to take this rough terrain because I passed it up. But I kind of know where I'm going and not hit nothing. Boom, boom, boom. Look at that. We out of here. You cruising, though. Yeah. Real. Nice. Okay. Vin Farrow. <laughs> hey, man, you know, we out here. Oh, oh okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay. okay. Do it, take it. Is that a jump? Nah, it's supposed to. Oh, yeah. it's not a jump? Wait. The show thought that was a jump. Oh, well, let me in. Hold on. some reason they won't let me in my bunker hey they done pushed you out as an investor dang man that's crazy like, well, who? well then it's it's time to head to the city guys are y'all ready to head to los santos yes let's get los it in Santos. and get us a mission in we we gonna take a little spin in the iron man mach one we out of the bay let's get out of Polito bay So, man, what's some of the, the most fun things that y'all love about Grand Theft Auto, man? Just from all of them, like Vice City, San Andreas, just even to, to today. Yeah, the way it's driving in the, in the cars. It's just, it's, it's just the no consequence freedom. It's just you get to let a little bit of your psycho, you know, thoughts that you be having just in traffic. <laughs> just come out. Yeah, you just get to speed. Without worried about getting a, a ticket or getting pulled over and, you know, doing what cops do, which is terrifying now in L.A. or everywhere. Um, you get to just, you know, do what you want with guns, drugs. Like, you're a fucking drug lord in here, and you just get to turn this off, and then you go back to, you know, society. <laughs> this is true. It could brew some psychopaths, but it's just perfect. It's just like, it's just like you know, open, free, consequence-free living. It's like The Sims, but with, you know... Heroin. And yeah. heroin. A lot of heroin. A lot of heroin. What would you guys say the best one is? Ah, uh, man, I'm still a San Andreas person, man. Really? Vice City, Vice too. Vice City is crazy Vice close, City though. really fun, too. I played the shit out of both of them. Like, Vice City was memorable. I think just because we're black, we'd be saying Los Santos, but Vice City was, like, pretty much up there. And as good as this one is and how, like, they keep adding on... I still think those are my top two. Oh yeah, I oh, think yeah. And honestly, for San Andreas, it was more really the place than it was just him. Like it was dope that it was told from our perspective, but also just the combination of like San Francisco, Las Vegas, Los Angeles, all put into one fucking thing. Like that shit was amazing. Like having to go do like missions in the casino, having to be in the backwoods racing, going down like fucking hippie hill that's in uh san andreas that shit was amazing to do but like you said too though vice city was just such a miami type of feel like you felt like you were there like that's still one that's kind of like for me final fantasy 7 like if you remade vice city right now everybody would buy that a remake hell yeah well like this quality yes that'd be fucking insane i think that the the, another thing that just set that off was the music. It was so yes. good. And we don't n typically listen to music like that. So I consider Grand Theft Auto up there with Tony Hawk's Pro Skater in crossover with music. Like it just introduces oh, yeah. to, us to so much stuff that we don't typically listen to, which I love about video games. Funny thing about that. My uh, homeboy. Right oh my 
my uh, homeboy I went to school with. Oh yeah, no, I'm like I am an ace when it comes to the driving in here. Uh, my homeboy's mom actually discovered Future through Grand Theft Auto, no. and she's white, and she loves it. What uh, what song? How it was. You know, hit the black and sell drugs. That's exactly how it was. I'm the dope man, dope man. Yes, I am. Turn your baby mama. It was on like uh one of uh Esco's albums though. Ah, that doesn't sound familiar. Doesn't ring a lean bell. But yeah, she listened to that. She was like, I like him. And she's a future fan now. That's amazing. Video games will do that. And most video games have original music, so it's like this one is one of the few that can put you on to like popular music. Can I not get in my house? Your, uh, your keys are just not working today, what baby. What the bro. fuck is going on? Over here, what is good? Like, yo, like, I can't get into anything right now. You just going to park in the red, huh? Yeah, man, I live here. Fuck this. What I is... Yo, like, what is going on? Uh, sir, do you live here? Sir, do you have a key? Which is it not accessible multiplayer? Or did you never have this ever? No, I've, I, like this is my house. Like you see the green, right there. I see nothing. You don't see that green symbol I'm standing on top of, mm-hmm. indicating this is my house. Uh. Uh-uh. That is wild as fuck. Seems made up. Hey, this nigga was lying. Can I even go get my club? Hey, nigga, done froze your assets. Somebody done froze a brother's Enemy assets. Enemy of the I, is this what Will Smith was feeling like? <clears throat> so how do you do like little missions? You could just go and upload them. Upload I need, them. Oh, uh, well, like upload to missions that's currently happening, or you could start your own. Start your own? Yeah. There's no like people that like sit around giving out missions? No, they have those too. Like you can go to Lester and Lester will give you a mission. You can go to your clubhouse. Hey, your clubhouse will have like little small missions you could do and stuff to gain things. I'm finna take y'all one like a survival one. Okay. I just need to understand why I'm not being able to get into anything. Oops. Anything from the tokeners. I think I mean, okay. so have you guys looked at the wheel that you could get? Yes. I was debating getting one. I mean, it looks sick. And to be honest, like, to have it just in front of a 40, 50 inch TV, that's a sick ass setup. Like, to have Grand Theft Auto playing with the wheel. The, or even, like, this you know, mode is crazy. Like, yeah, with this. Uh-uh. Playing yeah. with the wheel like that? Come on, that's dope. Uh-uh. That's too much for me. I don't that's... know who that's for. Yeah, I'm There's like no way that that's like works for anybody. Y'all, are, that's the type of people that like Forza. Like that's y'all. See, that's, you is that how Forza shoots it? No, I mean people would do that though, like with Forza. Uh oh. The hell? What happened? Uh oh. What happened? I don't know. Did we reset? Oh, it may be because of that new uh, that update. Yeah. Cause you're supposed to get like a million dollars now in your update. Really? Yeah. Why? It's just a giveaway for the next three, four days. That's tight. Yeah, they can they hit you with a firewall for all your stuff. Well, I'm probably trying to add that into it. So question, who had the best storyline out of the Grand Theft Autos from three to up now? Probably who- Los Santos. San Andreas or this one? San Andreas. Man, I played Vice City a lot. Still? Vice City was still, dope. I played it a lot. Like, I remember that story being sick, man. The, I mean, they I were mean, both I really used good. To love the motorcycles. The, it was such a different look than San Andreas was. was Vespas like, and shit. Yeah. Yeah, it was sick. Beach Ferraris, the Ferraris. Bro, and like, yeah, the old school look. Yeah, I, I, they both were good. Well, I, you could rule out Grand Theft Auto Four because that was trash. The Russian dude, what was it, Nico? Yeah, yeah, yeah Four. That one was garbage. I was like, I couldn't get with it. There's nothing relatable about it. I was like, I have no friends like this. <laughs> I have no friends like this. Um, no, that was true. Like I could, I couldn't really relate to it. 
I played through, a, I feel like I was a fan enough of the series enough where I played through like maybe half of it, but I just, I just put it down. But it has to be between those. The Grand Theft Auto Five has a great storyline, but it's like kind of mem- not memorable. It's Trevor not. is great, but yeah, it's still kind of basic. That's so funny. Uh, I don't know. Okay, let me. Uh, I'm a. I'm a refresh everybody's memory. I'm gonna just read a synopsis of both storylines. Hit the block and sell the drugs. That's exactly how it was. All right, Victor Vic Vance. That was three, right? This was Vice City. Vic had an impoverished, uh, uh, impoverished uh, upbringing with two brothers, Pete, who's suffering from asthma, and Lazy Lance. To make money for his dysfunctional family, Vic is employed as a corporal for the U.S. Army. Uh, that was a long ass plot. God damn. Jeez. I wanted a synopsis. I was watching them scroll. That thing no, did not like, end. Like his yeah. I'm like, damn. All right, whoa. Yeah, compress this shit. Yo, well, that already didn't sound that too interesting, so. Uh, this is stories. I think the like it's so immediately terrible. Think oh, Tommy that? Versetti. That sounds way more you think they, like, give Yeah, that's Vice City, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's what, okay. I thought his uh, name started with a T. So you think they give it like a more, more scarier disease? The, oh, the coronavirus? Yeah. That's about what they did. What is it actually, how is it actually pronounced? I have no idea. Okay, damn, this is a long ass. This is a long it. load. Yeah, huh? this load's ridiculous. Too long. Vice the storyline summary. Uh oh, Mythical Banshee is online. We're gonna do a submission. If Mythical Banshee, if you're watching this, just hold tight, brother. We are doing a mission together. Okay. The game follows Tommy Versetti during his release from prison. After he's caught up in an ambush drug deal, he seeks out those responsible while building a criminal empire and seizing power from other criminal organizations. Pretty basic. That was very basic. All right. What about. Uh, San Andreas. San Andreas was wild. Cause CJ, I remember CJ shit. Oh, hell yeah. <clears throat> Super jump, extra strength punch, flying cards. Flying cards yeah. That was insane. Which one was that? San Andreas? San Andreas. Yeah. Carl is sent on a journey that takes him across the entire state of San Andreas to take control of the streets before hell breaks loose. In 1987, after his brother Brian was killed, CJ escaped the city of Los Santos, a place overrun by crime and corruption, to Liberty City. Yep. Oh, that's where the third one was, right? Yeah. That's the motherfucking Green Saber. <laughs> Is that a mission? Yeah, it was just funny how he said it because they were sneaking uh, on one of his homeboys who was working with the feds. And, uh, no, with the cops. And the cops, one of them, uh, Samuel Jackson, talked as him. And, and they were pulling out like the green sa- uh, a saber. And he was like, that's the motherfucking green saber. <laughs> of course he did. Does you think he <laughs> makes it like, do you think he adds it to the movie script that he has to say motherfucker? Or do people write that for him now? I, I, yeah. I was watching this, uh, no, I was reading this thing about um, the actors, voice actors for all those games. Apparently, they don't get cut a good deal or something. It's weird. Oh, yeah, the dude actually, uh, Frank, that was on here, uh, was had mentioned that. Really? Yeah, the guy that plays Frank, he was the one that uh, came out saying that. Uh, Curry, uh, damn, I can't say this word. Uh, Turritopsis. Turritopsis says koala bears are evil. What do you guys think about that? Why? Have you heard them? Have you like heard the sound that they make? It's pretty I evil. I have not. I have not heard that. It's pretty evil. It's the um, sound that they make. Like when they do what? Like, like just koalas. You know the sound that they make. Like how cows say moo. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't know koalas had a distinct sound. I didn't either. Watch this. I did not know they that. They were just like little cub bears. Thing. All right, if this doesn't work, 
Um, y'all are gonna get y'all are in for a treat. Is this did the loading stop? It's just taking forever, I think, because of it being on Wi-Fi and trying to load up the map. You know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna wait till this go out. Wait. Like no, who's That's making the that... sound in the back? It's it's usually that growling one. Yeah, you don't hear that in the back. Oh, Here it go. Look how nasty these things are. Whoa, what the fuck? That's like predator noises, yo. That's so weird. It sounds like a burp too. Ew. They're disgusting. So it's like all is all disgusting. You know what, the guys? The fact that they made them cute is on some bull. Got a little treat for y'all today. Pat, you know what time it is, Pat? What up? Give y'all something a little special today. Y'all ready for this? 